Hey, I am back and I wanted to do a video. This is sort of a roses for non-rose lovers video because I find that rose is a note I really struggle with. Um, and so I wanted to kind of put together the ones that I found over the last 12 years or so that I really enjoy wearing. And I have a new love that I just found today, so I'm going to share that at the end. The first one is the Lardisan Saffron True Blunt. This is a great kind of gourmand. Um, wonderful creamy rose. I really love this one in the winter time. It's really beautiful. Those 15 milliliter bottles, I don't know that they sell them on their own. That may have come as part of a set. I bought it from somebody. So, um, but I know they definitely, this one's still in production. You can find it easily anywhere that you can find Larson fragrances. The next one I'm going to talk about is something that's easily found at Sephora because I get that question from people. Sometimes they're like, I just need something that I can find at Sephora and that would be Stella McCartney Stella. Um, I have and have worn that over the years. It's a really pretty rose amber fragrance. It has a great salty note to it, um, which you guys know how I love that salty note in fragrances. So um, I definitely recommend checking that out in Sephora. I want to say that one is like in the 50 to $75 range. So I think you can buy like smaller, smaller bottles of that for like 50 and some dollars, somewhere in that range. Um, the next fragrance that I want to talk about is the Andy Tower Unrose Sheeper. That is one of those fragrances that I always find on my list of like, oh, I really want to buy that. And it's always like somewhere in that top 10, but it's never available. Like a lot of times I'll buy from other fragrance board members or something. They'll be selling a partial bottle. And that's a lot of times how I... Guys, I'm serious. I've told you I'm serious with my budget dollars. Like, I don't just drop change on anything that comes along brand new. Because I'm... You gotta keep the perfume funds in line. Don't be racking up your credit cards, people. Get yourself deep in debt. Unless you have the money to do it. I'm here to tell you. I love perfume, and I'm a big finance person, too. So, you can ask me questions about either one. Um... But yeah, that Andy Tower, like nobody ever sells it. Nobody ever has it for sale. So people must love that thing. They just hold on to it forever. The next one I'm going to talk about, this is probably one of my favorite fragrances. It's in my top 10, definitely. Um, Teo Cabanel Oha. This line does not get enough love. So show them some love. This is a beautiful rose and it has... Um, a lovely, really bright, like citrus bergamot top notes and tea notes. This is really beautiful in humid weather, like, you know, when it's hot, like it just comes out such a beautiful, refreshing scent. I really love this one. It has great lasting power um, and it just makes me feel really put together. I really love it. The last one that I'm going to talk about, I just got today, and I love it so much. I was so surprised that I love this, is the Surge. La Fille de Berlin, probably butchering the name. Look at the beautiful red juice. Ooh, so pretty. Bought this from a fragrance board member. Um, so I got a really great deal. I hadn't smelled it before and, you know, was able to get a really great deal on 10 milliliters of fragrance. And now I know I love it so I can go ahead and get myself the full bottle. So I have it in my collection. But that is really beautiful. And if you've been watching... Another reviewer, Lionel Woods, who does great reviews. He is here in the Dallas area as well. It's been really humid here lately. So this, uh, I wore it today and it just bloomed absolutely beautifully in the Dallas humidity. So it's got a lovely jamminess to it, but it really smells like a natural rose to me. So, and I think this one is probably in the $110 range for a full bottle. I think that's what the um, surges go for generally in this area. You can find like Parfum One has sales on them a lot. I don't know if they have this one though because it's brand new. Um, Lucky Scent, Perfume Shop, you can find this thing anywhere. So um, if you have any questions for me about this rose or other roses, just drop me a line. Thanks everybody. Bye.